Hi, in this video, we are going to discuss uh, problems involving equations of a circle. What is the equation of a circle with center at the origin and the radius is 9? Now remember that if your center is at the origin, the coordinate is 0, 0. So if you will use the equation of a circle, your h and k will be 0, 0, and your radius 9 will be raised to the second power. So if we will look for the equation of a circle, that's going to be x squared plus y squared is equal to 81. Problem number 2. What is the equation of a circle with center at 13, negative 13, and the radius is 4 units? So in this case, so substitute natin yung h and k doon sa ating formula. And then it's going to be x minus 13 plus y minus minus 13 is equal to 4 squared. Now, tanong natin ulit, balikan natin, paano to naging positive 13? Kasi y minus minus 13 yan. So, negative times negative, magiging positive. And then, 4 squared, evaluate nyo na lang yan. So, it will give us the equation x minus 13 squared plus y plus 13 squared is equal to 16. Number 3. What's the equation of a circle with center at 2, negative 4? And the radius is 4 units. So, using the same uh, formula. Okay, so x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is equal to r squared. So, yung h nyo ay 2 at yung k nyo is negative 4. So, magiging x minus 2 plus y minus minus 4. Kaya naging y plus 4 squared is equal to r. That's equal to 4 squared. So, that will give us this equation of the circle. Number four. Number four. What's the equation of a circle with center at negative 7, 1 and radius is 15 units? So, gamit yung formula natin, substitute natin ulit. So, magiging x minus minus 7 plus y minus 1 is equal to 15 squared. So, paano to naging positive? Kasi nga, x minus minus 7. So, evaluate nyo na lang yung 15 squared. So, that will give us x plus 7 squared plus y minus 1 squared is equal to 225. Number 5. What is the equation of a circle with the center at 0, negative 2 and radius is 11 units? So, gamit yung formula natin, substitute nyo yung h nyo 0, yung k nyo negative 2. So, magiging x minus 0 squared plus y minus minus 2. So, magiging y plus 2 na yon squared is equal to 11 squared. So, yung equation ng circle natin ay ito. Number, number 6. Where is the center located in the given equation x squared plus y squared is equal to 49? Now, remember, kapag ganito, walang h, walang k. So, ibig sabihin, your center is at 0, 0. Number 7. Where is the center located in the equation x squared plus y squared is equal to 225? Now, tingnan nyo to equation natin. So, dito si x, walang value si h dyan. At ito, wala rin value si k. So, that means yung center natin is at 0, 0. Number 8. What's the measure of the radius in the equation x squared plus y squared is equal to 49? Now, remember, ito yung ating, yung makukuna natin ng value ng ating radius. So, paano? You just get the square root. So, yung square root ng 49 is equal to 7. So, ibig sabihin, ang radius natin is 7.
9. Where is the center located in the equation x plus 11 squared plus y plus 8 squared is equal to 16? So, paano natin kukunin yung ating center dito? So, by getting the value of your h, so dito makukuha yung h, at dito naman makukuha yung y. Gawin lang is change the sign. Okay? So, center is at negative 11, negative 8. Ten. Where is the center located in the equation x plus 7 squared plus y minus 6 squared is equal to 81? So, paano natin mahanap yung hk, yung center? So, ito at saka ito. That's your h and your k. Palitan yung sign natin. So, positive 7 magiging negative 7 at yung negative 6 magiging positive 6. So, yung center nyo is negative 7, 6. Number 11, where is the center of the circle located? So, ang gagawin nyo na lang is ipa-plot nyo, hanapin nyo dun sa uh, point na yon yung location. So, first is, let's look for x. So, yung x nyo ay nandito sa negative axis. So, dito ay to, negative 3. And then, nandito naman sa positive 3. Okay, that's the center of the circle. So, center is at negative 3, 3. Number 12. What is the equation of the given circle? So, dito kailangan nyo muna kunin yung center. So, ang center natin ay nandito sa negative 3, positive 3. Ang radius natin, paano mabibilang? Gamit tayo ng ibang color. So, from the center, bilang tayo 1, 2, 3 units. So, radius is 3. So, substitute natin. Yung h natin, negative 3. At yung k natin ay positive 3. So, palitan ng sign yung negative 3 at palitan, palitan ng sign yung positive 3. So, magiging x minus minus 3 yon so x plus 3 squared plus y minus 3 squared is equal to 3 squared. So that will give us the equation x plus 3 squared plus y minus 3 squared is equal to 9. Number 13. What's the given equation of the circuit? Okay, kunin muna natin yung coordinates ng ating center. So, kung dito tayo, so yung center natin, kunin muna natin yung x-axis natin as na negative, tapos dito naman siya sa negative 2. So, ang center ay negative 3, negative 2, at yung radius pa paano nakuha. Okay, let me just erase this. So, bibilangin nyo lang kung ilang units pa taas, or pa kanan, or pa kaliwa. Hanggang makarating doon sa circumference ng circle. So, 1, 2, 3. Radius is 3. So, substitute nyo yun dun sa ating formula. And then, x minus minus 3 squared plus y minus minus 2 squared is equal to 3 squared. So, magiging x plus 3 squared plus y plus 2 squared is equal to 9. Number 14. How long is the radius? So, dito, madali lang. Kailangan lang bilangin kung ilang units pataas or pababa. So, here, the radius is 3. Number 15, what's the coordinate of the center of the circle? So, dito, sa ating circle, hindi naman nagpunta ng left or right yung ating origin. Ang ginawa niya is umakit lang siya sa positive 3. Wala siyang x. So, kasi yung x ang movement dapat is either nasa kaliwa na sa kanan. Pero ito nandun na siya sa y-axis. So, ibig sabihin, the center is at 0, positive 3. Number 16, what's the radius? So, from the center, bilangin natin 1, unit, 2, 3. So, the radius is 3. Number 17, 
what's the equation of the circle? So, knowing na yung ating center is at 0, positive 3, reduce is 3. So, sa substitute na lang natin siya dun sa formula. So, x minus 0 squared plus y minus 3 squared is equal to 3 squared. So, ang formula natin or ang equation of the circle is x squared plus the quantity of y minus 3 squared is equal to 9. 18. Where is the center of the circle? So, hanapin nyo muna yung una sa x-axis. Dito ay positive 4. Tapos, sa y ay negative 3. So, yung center natin is at 4, negative 3. Number 19. What is the radius of the circle? So, ang gagawin na lang natin is we just count ilang units from the center. So, tingnan nyo po dito ha. This is 4 and then this is 5. So, ibig sabihin yung movement from here to this point is 1 unit. So, ibig sabihin yung radius is equal to 1. Number 20. What's the equation of the circle? So, knowing na yung center natin is at 4, positive 4, negative 3. And yung radius natin is 1. So, yung ating formula, substitute lang natin. So, magiging x minus 4 squared plus y minus minus 3. Kaya naging plus 3 squared is equal to 1 squared. So, ang value or yung formula natin or equation natin for this circle is the quantity of x minus 4 squared plus the quantity of y plus 3 squared is equal to 1. Twenty-one. What's the coordinate of the center? So, ang gagawin lang natin is, punta muna tayo sa x-axis ng ating center. So, ito ay positive 1. Tapos, dito naman ay positive, ah, sorry, negative 3. So, the coordinate of the center is 1, negative 3. 22. What's the equation of the circle? So, knowing that your center is found at 1, negative 3, and the radius is 2, so yung ating formula is x minus h, that's positive 1, ilalagay, so x minus 1, plus y minus k, ay y minus minus 3 squared is equal to 2 squared. So, evaluate nyo na lang yung 2 squared, so that will give us at the equation, x minus 1 squared plus the quantity of y plus 3 squared is equal to 4. 23, what's the equation of the circle? So, hanapin muna natin yung center at yung radius. So, yung center natin is found at positive 2, negative 1. And then, the center is gamit tayo yung ibang color. So, from the center, 1, 2, 3, 4 units. So, using the formula x, the quantity of x minus h squared plus quantity of y minus k squared is equal to r squared. So, substitute na lang natin. And then, evaluate yung 4 squared. That will give us this equation. So, nod. 24. What's the equation of the circle? So, again, hanapin nyo muna yung location ng center. So, siya ay nandito sa positive 1, negative 4. At yung center niya ay, from the center, ang radius niya ay 1, 2, 3 units. So, radius is 3. So, gamit yung ating equation or yung formula, x minus h squared plus y minus k squared is equal to r squared. Evaluate yung 3 squared. So, yung equation of the circle is uh, the quantity of x minus 1 squared plus y, quantity of y plus 4 squared is equal to 9. Let's go to the last example, number 25. What is the equation of the circle? So, hanapin muna natin yung center at saka radius. So, ang center niya, 
Dito sa x-axis natin, negative 2. Tapos sa y-axis ay positive 1. At ang kanyang radius, erase muna natin sundali. So, from the center, bilang tayo papunta doon sa circumference. So, from the center, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. O, kaya kung ayaw niyo dyan, dito. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, what's the equation? So, substitute natin. x minus minus 2 squared plus y minus 1 squared is equal to 5 squared. Evaluate na lang natin yung 5 squared. So, that will give us this equation of the circle. Okay, I hope you learned something today. Kung nahihirapan, pwedeng panoorin ulit yung video. At don't forget to practice of my time. Now, if you find this video helpful, pakipress ang like, pakipress ang share, and then mag-subscribe na rin for new updates. Thank you. Have a good day.